have something a little bit crazy planned. So let's get started. It's only just springtime and I already miss skiing, but the chairlift isn't running because the resort is closed for the season. The advantage of being a crazy lunatic is that I've got a plan to walk up. Well, maybe, unless it's melted down to grass already. Anyways, it's gonna happen. So I hope you're ready. Welcome to Sweller Than Dweller. It is a glorious day in May, and we are at the ski resort. The parking lot is empty, and we're the only ones here. Why? Because the season is over. Or is it? My friends, we are going skiing. Well, we've hardly even climbed at all, and we've already found snow. Don't worry. It'll be okay. Trust me. Look guys, people just don't understand that May is like prime ski season in Canada. Oh, well look at this. What do we got here? Oh, a box of tissues. And not even opened. Score! I find so much loot when I do this. It's awesome. One time I was out here and I was actually on the downhill. I was cruising along and I saw some paper sticking out of the snow. And I immediately stopped, came to a skidding halt and went back and looked. $20 bill, my friends. Score! I don't know how that happens. Right in the middle of the ski run. It must have been like a storm or something. And someone was unzipping their pocket looking for something and $20 fell out. And the snow covered it up quickly. And it was not to be seen until springtime. The middle of May. When... Sweller Van Dweller comes out for a ski. <laughs> it's just a little water. It'll be okay. Well, it doesn't look like there's much of a lift line. So far, I've climbed over half a kilometer vertical and uh, it's starting to look like winter up here again despite the nuclear sun it's gonna be good just wait well there it is guys the top of the resort I just have to get up there don't think there's a lot of snow up here in the middle of May well I have to somehow find a way over this bit windy up here, but sweet mercy, we've made it! It's been a couple hours of solid grinding, climbing with the skins, 750 vertical meters, but we're finally at the top, and uh, the views are beautiful! Oh, this is the life. Now that we're at the top, you know what time it is. No, no, it's not time to go down. It's time for lunch and pierogies. And not only that, potato and bacon pierogies. Solid ski power, my friends. Add to that 
a little bit of fresh tea. What more can you want? <sighs> but yes, my friends, soon we go down. Okay, guys, enough fooling around. It's time to crank it up. <laughs> Glorious, my friend, glorious. Do that. That was a blast. Almost 500 vertical meters going down. But I don't think we're done. We should go for another lap. Let's do it. It would be an absolute crime if we didn't go up again. Let's refuel and hit lap number two. Well guys, we're coming up on more treasure. Oh man, even I have my limits. That thing is trashed. Well guys, overall, conditions out here are fantastic. It's a bluebird day, a little bit of wind. Uh, higher up, it's a bit icy, which throws you off, but then you get down lower and uh, it can get a bit slushy. There's nothing like going along at a clip of 30 kilometers an hour and then hitting a sunny spot where the snow suddenly grabs you and slows you down instantly by 10 kilometers an hour and almost makes you do a Superman head over heels. But there is that sweet spot of elevation right in the middle where it's absolutely buttery smooth. Awesome skiing. Ah, oh, today my friends, we live. If you don't think I'm just some sort of crazy lunatic, I'd appreciate it if you give the video a thumbs up and subscribe because it's the only way you can support me and let me know that you like what I'm doing and you want me to continue. And I'd also suggest to YouTube that it should introduce other like-minded people to the fun that we have at Sweller Van Dweller. That's it for now. Thanks for coming along, and we'll see you next time on Sweller Than Dweller.